vous n'avez jamais ouvert les yeux. Encore aujourd'hui, je sens votre parfum. Le pardon, I felt like I heard a few murmurs of confusion about that film. Um, do anybody, does anybody want to explain to me why you were confused? Like, what did you get? Or uh, I thought it was a fun take on like the genre in general. Um, I had assumed she was maybe like a widow, who just kind of distraught, experiencing, I guess, the horror of losing someone. And she was alone, as he was saying, or repeating, really. Um, I like how it's like, obviously they had a low budget, but I like how it's always very close, kind of in her head with a lot of shots towards, maybe when he lowered the voice and it was all like close to her ear, and you could kind of see just the angles they were taking were geared towards how she was feeling throughout, but it was only her alone and his dialogue. I just thought it was very unique and fun to see horror in that portrayal. Yeah, it was a very kind of poetic portrayal of horror, which I thought was nice. And I don't, I don't know, maybe some people wouldn't classify this horror. Did anybody think it really wasn't horror? You didn't think it was horror? Do you no. know what they got? Well, Long guy didn't think it was horror. <laughs> 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 we'll just bring it back over here if you guys want to just tell me why, why you didn't think it was horror at all. No, I don't really, I mean, for me, I guess, like you said before when we were starting, is that horror can be perceived in lots of different ways. I mean, yes, I do think that if, if it was his spirit talking to her or she's imagining what he would say or whatever, but I, don't, I didn't find it creepy or mysterious or horrifying or thrilling in any kind of way. Like it was just sort of a slightly eerie moment is how I would classify that. And I feel like maybe it's, it's how you get into it with that one. Because it's, it's kind of horrifying and I, I thought it was like a ghost talking to her or her own mind. So that can be kind of creepy as if like your own mind is haunting you or, or if it really is a ghost that you're hearing and you're just in a room alone, that's, that's pretty creepy. <laughs> well, first of all, <clears throat> it's a low budget, but they had a great set, and they did a really nice job on the costume, and we fill in the rest, and that, that's how it worked, and on that level, it shows how you can, if you get a couple of solid elements visually, the rest, the rest of it will work.